This was a population-based study in which researchers identified almost a quarter of a million new cases of dementia in Ontario over 11 years, and it pinpointed where those people lived in relationship to highways and busy arterial roads. And what they found was that those who lived within 50 meters or half a city block from a major road or highway had a 7% higher risk of developing dementia than seniors who lived farther away. For a disease that's so common, the study's authors say that number is significant and they call it another piece of evidence that would argue that steps need to be taken to reduce traffic-related pollution and that that could have some public health benefits. Now, the science explaining the cause and effect between pollution and dementia is still preliminary. Now, we took these findings to the head of geriatrics at Mount Sinai Hospital in Toronto. He wasn't involved in the research, and he agreed the findings were interesting, but he says the best evidence still points to smoking as the greatest risk factor in developing most forms of dementia, not pollution. Uh, though he agreed more research needs to be done to try to understand what this association means and how that may inform better environmental practices. Now, despite the need for more research, the study's authors agree that the findings should at least be taken into account when people are looking for a place to live. Vicodopia, CBC News, Toronto.